This is a Sting Greenlight trailer for photographs where you've got to collect 50 photos. 50? I mean, most Slender clones will just stick with the requisite eight. 50? Okay, so you got to find 50 photographs in this. This, this rather indistinct set of trees. Now, I've, I've, I'll, I'll tell you now, I've, I've watched the entire trailer and I, there are no distinguishing landmarks. You know how, like, Slender had landmarks so that you could get a rough idea of where you've been and what you've seen? This is just trees displaying a fundamental misunderstanding of the games that it's trying to ape, which is one of my big bugbears with a lot of these Me Too also ran games. Uh, a lot of them don't understand the actual the actual design of the game. They just see the surface elements and think, I can do that. And even then, looking at the frame rate and just the general darkness and the, the fact that this has gone on for ages with nothing happening displays that they can't even do that. One photograph has been found so far out of 50 with nothing but fucking really, really limp scare chords to break up the monotony. There was another one. Terrifying. Absolutely terrifying. Nothing's going on. It's nothing. It's just... Yeah, it's just trees. That's not exciting. Photographs. Of what? I don't know, but there's 49 to go. Oh, hold on. Yes. Look at this photograph! Description. Photographs is a minimalist horror game. You need to... C minimalist. That's, that's developer talk for no content. You need to collect all photographs around the forest. But remember, do not look at her. We don't know who she is. I mean, it, it, it's just a woman. It's just some person. Not, not There's nothing scary about just some lady in a dress. Note, for some reason, video has more light in that the actual game. Was, did I read that right? Was, a video has more light in that, the edge. No, I did read that right, okay. The screenshots show the real atmosphere of the game, and I love how atmosphere is in quotes, because even the developer knows it's bollocks. Speaking of bollocks, let's talk about Lord Krez, the developer, quote-unquote, behind this game. Lord Krez is the developer famous for Journey of the Light. That game that was released with one level uh, called itself impossible to beat to hide the fact that it was just one level and it became a, a, an incredible controversy and uh, was taken down from Steam for being a scam. And apparently you, despite releasing one of the most clear-cut fucking shady pieces of shit that's ever hit Steam, Lord Crest can just have another go, can just put something on green light, because no one's looking. Who cares? Who gives a shit? Let's release photographs. Why not? It seems to me the only way you actually get barred from Greenlight and, and Valve and Steam forever is to directly threaten Gabe Newell. That seems to be the only way to do it, which, you know, make no mistake, th threats and, and shit are awful and shouldn't be done, uh, but is, is that really the only thing? Like, like you, you try and scam your entire customer base and you still get a chance to, to get back on Steam. Like, that, 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 sh that doesn't seem right. His account should not be in any kind of good standing, but here it is. Photographs. Poss possibly the laziest, most slapdash Slender clone I've covered. Not, not, the, not the, the worst I've ever seen, or the worst that's ever been released. Uh, normally they're free on, you know, some fucking website or other. But this is certainly the laziest one I've ever covered, which is just, it's, it's Lord Krez, it's classic Krez. So, at least, at least the developer's consistent. Fuck this game. Fuck it off. 